Hi folks, welcome back to the channel, or welcome if you haven't been before. My name is Watto and I wander about. That's Kim, say hello Kim. Hello Kim. She wanders about as well. Today we're in a little known village in the Cotswolds, but quite a famous one. And it's called Slad. Famously the home of renowned writer, screenwriter and poet, Laurie Lee. So let's go. So that is a lovely little village in the Cotswolds, in the civil parish of Painswick, near Stroud, about two miles outside Stroud. Very famous for being the home of the renowned writer Laurie Lee. I say writer, he's also a poet and a screenwriter as well, so very good. One of his obviously most famous works is the autobiographical novel Cider with Rosie, which recounts his childhood as he grew up in the village very very good book still a very popular book and uh, in most schools is still set as an English literature um, subject so has stood the test of time very well He moved here in 1917 when he was three and uh, Cider with Rosie does portray his childhood in the village and then when he wrote the book um, with the proceeds he could afford to uh, go full time and bought a house back in the village which is where he lived. This is Holy Trinity Church, and that was the grave of the man himself. Very nice church, very nice village. That's a really peaceful little village, apart from the main road down there. <laughs> um, very nice little wander around it at the moment so far. It is quite early on a Saturday morning, so there's a lot of people not quite venturing out yet. It's very interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Seeing where Laurie Lee has uh, mm. lived. Very quaint. Yeah, it is. Mm. A quintessential Cotswold village. village. Oh. Very nice too. Mm. 
it is said, or well, he did say, that he wrote the book three times <laughs> to get it right and took him two years. Norrie Lee did come back and live in Slough and uh, sadly died here on the 13th of May 1997 and that's where he's buried. And a very famous Woolpack Inn. Very nice pub, I have been in there a few times. There's a Lorry Lee Wildlife Way and dotted all along them are these posts with examples of his poems in. <laughs> well, we hope you enjoyed that little glimpse into the uh, village where Lorry Lee was born and lived. If you have, hit the like button, drop us a comment below, tell us what you liked about it. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. We'll see you on the next one. Say goodbye, Kim. Bye, Kim. Goodbye, Kim.